You're watching the WH Health News Report. I'm Randy Alvarez. Today's topic, the importance of fish oils in your diet for longevity and overall well-being. With us, we have Christiana Paul. She is a, a nutritionist, a health educator, and uh, an expert on this topic. Christiana, welcome to the program. Thank you. Now, you have a master's degree in nutrition. Yes. Is that right? And you also, you know, unique position. You teach medical doctors how to use nutrition to treat various diseases. Diseases. Yes, is and right? support optimal health. I mean, okay. first of all, everybody ha needs a foundation of a multivitamin and essential fatty acids such as fish oils. Uh, most of everybody uh, ha have heard about the need for fish oils. Now, Why? What are the benefits? I mean, what, what the benefits? You can think from top to bottom. You know, okay. starting with hair, eyes, brain, your mood. Um, reducing the risk of degenerative brain conditions and degenerative eye conditions, skin, your arteries, your heart, the cardiovascular system, um, everywhere in the body, inflammation that will be reduced by by fish oils, uh, the flow of the blood, the, the less risk of blood You know, I read articles that, uh, that, that fish oils can even slow the onset, I guess there's really no proof, but of Alzheimer's disease. Oh, absolutely. Or keep that absolutely. Under control. Because, it, you know, the Alzheimer's uh, disease process involves inflammation, involves certain metabolites, things that are made from certain types of fats in the body. But, bottom line is, the brain contains a lot of fish oils um, in order to help it function better. But, on the other hand, fish oils reduce inflammation in the brain that can cause. So, throughout other the whole things. body. It's about Fishers. the whole body, the way your uh, blood vessels, uh, they will be more constricted. You're going to have higher blood pressure if you don't have enough fish oils. You're going to be more likely to clot and have a heart attack or a stroke if you don't have enough fish oils. Inflammation. Are there um, studies that show that people that take fish oils live longer? I mean, people that actually eat more fish live longer? Are there longevity studies like this? Not longevity studies. However, I'm sure we can take a look at the uh, quality of life. I mean, it's not all about living longer, but do you have less degenerative diseases of okay. aging, such as uh, the Alzheimer's or cardiovascular disease, um, diabetes, rheumatoid arthritis, all the autoimmune Good for all conditions. Those in, yeah, your nutrition, reduce, yes. in your nutrition consulting practice, is that something that everybody needs? I mean, is that like a staple, a good multivitamin? And fish oils. Oh, right? absolutely. And we test people. We test their blood and we can see we it. Show a that rampant, low. a rampant deficiency. Yes. And until we, we test it, we, they, they don't believe you. Uh, at the most, they'll say, oh, how many capsules should I take? Maybe I'll take one. Okay. But when you see how deficient they are, I'm sorry, you have to take the about, you know, three or four or six capsules, especially if you don't eat fish. Now, some people will eat a lot of fish and we have to worry a little bit about what other things we have in fish, such as toxins and Yeah, uh, that's heavy why metals. I brought you on this uh, report this week, because, uh, you know, obviously you're a science person, okay, that not all fish oils are created equal. Is that right? Yes. And, uh, you know, some have mercury in them. Is that right? Well, some have yeah, other the toxins. fish itself has well, it, and then when about, you make well, the fish okay. oil, yeah, you're absolutely right. Now, the best, I've done my research, I'm allowed to say this, I guess I'm not a licensed health practitioner, but the, you know, what you're carrying, with the, and this is not a sales pitch, but on the market, this triglyceride formula is, is kind of like the, the, the real the oil from form. the fish. The exactly, exactly. So, and yeah, not all, uh, all uh, fish oils are created equal because. Um, the, uh, I was taking old, another fish oil, by the way. You're right. the one that converted me to this. And yes. I said, why am I taking the other one? Well, I said, took well, the other one for a long time, too, because I didn't know any better. Right. Uh, for the longest time, uh, people thought, oh, fish oils are beneficial because of these essential fatty acids. You can think of fish oils that they come from the fish kind of like a fork and a triglyceride, tri-fork kind of thing, okay. right? This is hard to understand, by the way, but keep going. Right, but anyway, so... Um, People used to clip off these these uh, 
fatty acids, they think, oh, these are the beneficial ones, and they cram them in a capsule, and they did studies, and it was beneficial to a certain extent, but that's not how they occur in fish. When you eat fish, like you, you eat this kind fish. of, okay. you squeeze a fish, you get this <laughs> fork of, of the three uh, fats that are hooked on to a backbone, so to speak. And if you eat it that way, the body is used to absorbing them a certain way, it's processed a certain way, it's safer, it's, so more, it's more absorbable, absorbable. more therapeutic, it's, would you say? It's more absorbable, more therapeutic therapeutic and safer. They don't oxidize so much because we just think of fish oils. What do they bring in as fish oils? But what else can they bring in as detrimental? Oxidized fats, oxidized fish oils are not good for you. That's why frying fish, you're never going to never gonna cook with fried fish fat, right? Because okay. it's, it's extremely peroxidized and oxidized. Once you oxidize them, forget it. They're not going to no have any benefit. Actually, they're going to have a detrimental effect by introducing so free radicals. you have radicals. to keep them in a cool place, or what do you have to do? Yes, but the way they're formulated, they have antioxidants. So being in this form, they're even more protective. So they're going to be more beneficial, more protective. And Is this it's, the highest it's a form new, of what you're talking it's about the best on the market? Form, yes, it's the best form that available. Seen, that you know of. Yes, yes, okay. absolutely. Uh, not and very it's kind of a new. The way. They're not that expensive. Luckily, uh, now suppliers offer them this way because now there's a demand for them. But again, it's kind of a, a, a new uh, finding. And most of the fish oils on the market, you'll see they're still in the ethyl ester form. And actually, you can't tell by looking at the label. I feel unfortunately. like it makes my skin feel be or better. More glowy kind of a skin. It, it uh, actually uh, will help you retain. To me as well. Oh, absolutely. It will re uh, fish oil will help you produce less stress hormone. Um, really? Based on, I mean, we all have like stress. Cortisol? Cortisol, yes. It helps with lowering it, or it controlling? It lowers, it controls, it reduces the, uh, the increase based on an event. Now we have, it not, it's not going to lower it to the point where you feel tired because you don't want to have too low. I don't want to say it lowers cortisol. Uh, to the point where uh, but it has an you don't feel on cortisol. good, but it 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 has a beneficial effect because if you're under stress, you're not going to produce excessive damaging uh, amounts of cortisol. We're out of time. Okay, so get a good fish oil. The best form we available today. We carry for health, and so you know they can visit our website and get it. They can get it at our at our office. And uh, well, I want to thank you so much for coming on the program, fish you're oils. Welcome. But this is a big topic, right? I well, mean, if I we think started now. How long could you talk on fish oils? What's your guess? Uh, well, I can Couple talk of days? forever. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> There's it, that much to it, right? Yes, I have binders and binders of research gathered at of the home benefits on, of on fish benefits oil. of and okay. they're coming out with new ones all the time. But the trick is how much we need to test people to figure out how much they need. Okay. Then we can see how much they absorb. We do that testing. And we do that testing, and right. it's it's very important because it depends on how much you've been taking since you were a child. Well, I want to thank you so much for coming on the program. You're welcome. Very interesting. You've been watching the WH Health News. We'll see you next week.